Hey there, guys. Um, so this is after the workout. Um, for some reason, the recording did not save or there was an error, you know, though I restarted it and it said there was an error. So I only knew that there was an error with the recording and when I hit stopped at the end. So I'm going to run through the workout with you guys uh, and demo each station uh, so you know what you're doing. Um, and then as long as you set a clock for yourself, you'll be good to go. Um, super easy, but I'll go over each station just so you know. And to follow the times that I have on WADA, um, we didn't go over. We didn't do more than we needed to. So warm up. You're going through three rounds, three rounds total. You have 10 push-ups. So just regular push-ups, going down, going up. Then once you're done 10, you have by the side, 10 total shoulder taps. And then you're going into a 30-second prisoner stretch, which is you're putting your hands on the wall, grabbing your head through, and holding that for 30 seconds, right? Going three times through. Then you're gonna put 10 minutes on the clock. In that 10 minutes, uh, you can, six sets is doable. Uh, so you have eight reps per arm. If you're using a band, you're stepping onto your band and you're going single sided. So eight strict presses on one side, eight strict presses on the other. Same idea with that dumbbell, eight per arm. If you have a weight that you can't do single arm, you're just gonna double up and you have 16 reps total, right? Strict press for that one. If you need to, when the sets get a little bit harder, you can add a little bit of a push, uh, but you're trying to make them as strict as you can. That one is paired with 10 aside TP shoulder taps. So a couple options in that TP position, tap your shoulders, or you can go into elevated, feet elevated, same thing. 10 aside shoulder taps, or if you are able to, you can do a handstand hold against the wall and do no shoulder taps. 10 reps per side, 20 total. That one you're hitting six rounds in the 10 minutes, all right? Then take a little bit of a break. The next station was a burner. Um, you're getting as far as you can on water. It shows a pyramid, so you're going up by twos all the way to 12, and then back down to as far as you can. I say that because I think I got to maybe 10 or started eight going down. So you have two movements. First one is our hand release push-up. You're doing two reps. Then you're going into our prowler push-up. So backing kind of like that mid child pose, and then you're coming forward into a push-up, a little more challenging, staying up on your toes. For that, easier options going from your knees, right? You go two, two, four, four, six, six, eight, eight, all the way up to 12, hitting 12 once, and then getting as far back down as you can. That is our second station. Six minute time cap for that one. And then same setup for the next station, six minutes as well. You're going up by twos, all the way to 12, and then back down. This one I got a lot farther. Um, so I got to, I think, the round of four. Uh, we're working on our core this time through. So you have alternating V setups. The reps you're doing per leg. So you're doing one, one, two, two. Then you have, again, per side of our reach through. So in that crunch position, reaching as far through one, one, two, two, and going back and forth between those, those two, doubling, I guess you're doubling the reps, depending on how you're counting it, all the way up to 12, and then back down as far as you can in the six minutes, okay? Then, our, what is that, one, two, three, four station. Um, on water, I think it says eight to 10 minutes, set an eight minute timer and aim to go every two minutes. 
So you have 20 swings, either with a plate, a dumbbell, a kettlebell, whatever you have, 20 swings. Then you're going into 20 sit-ups. If you want to make it more challenging, you can make those sit-ups be sits. And then you're going to take a little bit of a rest. My rest averaged anywhere from, I'd say, 40, maybe I'd say 35 seconds. It says a minute rest. You kind of judge it. Um, we were going in for four rounds for that one. And then the last station, six minutes on the clock, three rounds. You have 15 bicep curls. So again, if you have a weight that you do single arm with, uh, you can do single arm, um, but I did double arm, with both hands, uh, 15 reps. Then you have 15 dips, either on a chair, a stool, bench, stairs, 15 dips. The farther your feet are away, the harder it is. And then 15 per side of our plank twist, going side to side. All right, that's one, one, 15 a side, or 30 total. All right, that one you're getting three rounds in the six minutes. And that is it for the Wednesday. I apologize that the recording didn't work. I am not entirely sure what happened. It said it was working. But no matter, you just don't get to see me suffer today. And it was hard. <laughs> um, enjoy your workout and see you guys tomorrow. Bye.